Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back to some more Cairo Reignited Trilogy. When last time we left off, and by we I mean me, because none of you are actually here. Uh, we did a thing, and then we did another thing. And as per usual, that's as, uh, as about as descriptive of what happened yesterday as I'm going to get. Deal with it. Anyways, let's do another couple things today, shall we? Why does it look like his... Why was his mouth sparking? Kita was mean! I thought I was a gunner! Thanks for saving me. Yeah, and your stupid hide. Oh, I'm genuinely curious as to why I decided to... Whoa! <sighs> <sighs> Sorry about that. I'm genuinely curious as to why they decided to make all of these guys speak in haiku on this level. I'm sure there is a specific reason behind it. Yes, I am well aware that this is consistent with how they spoke in the original game. Maybe they thought it was funny, I don't know. Yeah, that little sparker you've got in your mouth, or that you swallowed, isn't gonna help you. And not even in the slightest. Excuse me? How dare you? We don't need those signs up. Let's get rid of that. Hey, if some poor unsuspecting person decides to go for a dip in the waters, Maybe they should know better than to go swimming in a swamp. Wait, can I... No, I have to get there from another... I'm doing something else. This door is jammed shut. Only the power of gems can hope to move it. You've made sure, a just wise shut up. choice. It will mean more eggs for you and more gems for me. Best of all, Spyro, I can stop speaking haiku. What a sweet relief. Most certainly would be a sweet relief for me when I get to chase you down and get all my money back. Oh, 
Ouch. You are brave, dragon. Much braver than I by far. Here, take this darn egg. When all lamps are lit, there is a secret in here that I will show you. Sure you will. There, that takes care of all the signs. Ah, why not? This swamp smells so sweet. The springtime trees are fragrant. I'm off to kick butt. Never heard anybody describe swamp as being sweet. We have the bombs here. We must destroy the egg gauge. But we just go boom. Kangaroo can help. You can clear the path for us. Will Sheila help us? Yes, it's bombing time. Here I come, my little eggs, to free you at last. remains. Will you now help my brother to freeze the last egg? If you clear my path, I can blow up the egg cage. Poor, poor captive eggs. Yes, it's bombing time. Here I come, my little eggs, to free you at last. I kind of compare this one to the uh, Alchemist mission from the second game. It just kind of goes all over the place. This Ow, might take a few attempts. I went boom again. Yes. Yes, I know what to do. So he doesn't run into anything until about... Third time's a charm? Maybe. Perhaps. Oh, I should play. Oh. I don't have to. Once I break the rock, they're just gone.
where are you going now? Ow! Yes! Alright. Third, uh, third? Fourth. Fourth time? Is definitely gonna do it. They don't necessarily roam around as much as the alchemist did. The eggs are all free! Two dragons are born today. Sheila's my hero. Alright. Gather the rest of the Mimba. all the way to the entrance. Yes? No? Yeah. So, I was wrong. There wasn't another egg here. Oh, well. I mean, me being wrong, not such a big surprise. With all lamps are lit, there is... Yes, I... Heard you the first time.
All righty then. Okay. Ah, there it is. How much more? One single gem. As per usual. Ah. Not always over here anyways. There's not a bad thing that I came back. There's not a bad thing that I came back. What you got to say the for yourself? The are lit. Now I'll tell you the secret of what's in this house. A creepy wizard lives inside but hates the light. He has awoken. He swore to destroy whoever lights the tea lamps. But they're using me. Coward. Double the length of time necessary in order to beat this guy. time and it's all over. Or not. God, that's over. Oh, boy. shortest levels in the game. 
fortunately enough. And relatively straightforward too. All right, what you gotta say for yourself, Spiral. Shrimplet? Rhinox have been harassing us all day. The workers haven't been able to harvest the bamboo needed for the whirly gig to take you to Evening Lake. We've tried asking them to leave, but there's no reasoning with them. Well, I guess, once again, it's up to me. That's pretty, pretty impressive. That's a pretty big stone slab there. And you moved it like it was nothing. What a jerk. Hello, ugly. What the heck did you come from? Just loaded down from the sky, old Mary Poppins style? That's uh, a little bit unusual. Ah, put a cork in it. Ah. I'm essentially just a glorified babysitter at this point. To be honest. Let's butt heads. I win. Hey, that's dangerous. You could hurt someone, particularly me. In memo, kids, never light a rock, never hold a rocket and then light it in your hand. Oh, the emergency escape bridge. Why didn't I think of it sooner? I shall activate it right away. Because you need me to do things for you, that's why you didn't think of it earlier. We would be honored if you would accept this as a token of our appreciation. All right. 
You got some real nerve, pal. What the? Of course. <sighs> Come back here. I'm going to get you. Told you. Explorers, there is no Yeti here, and there never was. He was just a myth, as far as you know. I'm not convinced. Okay. Now, where's that other portal? Why are they still standing on each other's heads? I mean, it's kind of impressive that they haven't crushed the hand on the bottom, but why are they still doing it? Whew. Okay, seriously though, where is the other... Oh! Holy, alright. Yeah! Yeah! There it be. Please help us, Spyro. My friends are trying to go home after a long shift in the fields. Those rotten Rhinox keep knocking them down. Can you save the panda workers? Please sure. hop aboard. Make sure to toast the Rhinox, but not my friends. Eh, I won't make any guarantees. What, no shing sound? It's like half the fun. People stand by strangers' doorsteps and just wait for them to come home to smack them with an umbrella. That's messed up. now notice that some of them are red pandas. All white. Please take the shiny egg. It will bring you good luck. I don't know if it'll bring me luck, but it'll certainly help me 100% in the game. 
That's for sure. Well, that's it then. Oops, gotta go this way. Now, before I call the day, how about I go back to, what is it, name of the level, escapes me, Let's and complete the Sergeant Bird cake. segment, nah, I'm good. Alright, Alton Crater, there we go. The adventure would continue if the level would load. a game of hide and seek with my friends if i can't find where they've hidden their heads they won't let me join the tiki lodge help me put them back together and i'll make you an honorary member all oh, right i forgot the dodos respawn Pressing the wrong button again. It shouldn't come as too much of a surprise. I'm an expert at wrong button pressing. Yes, that that is a thing, and totally not just something I made up right now. Is. I think there was another one around here somewhere. Hello there. Of your honorary membership to the lodge. 
I will. Well, that's never happened before. I hope it's not a bad omen. That's pretty standard, you know. Fertilized egg hatching, pretty common. Well, I mean to do that for the past couple episodes, but kind of been putting it off because I didn't want a specific video to run too long. I had thought about doing yesterday, but considering um, how much difficulty I had with the freaking speedway, I was like, yeah, no, no, no. Well, anyways, I think that'll wrap it up for today. Uh, thank you, everybody, for watching yet another one of my stupid videos. I still don't know how any of you are finding my dinky little channel in the back of YouTube, but I appreciate it all the same. I hope you all have a fantabulific day, and I'll see all of you, metaphorically and not physically, in the next video. Bye-bye!